Good morning. Happy Monday. Waylon is not taking breakfast. He has been on this eat breakfast at school kick, which we're fine with, but he definitely loves the lunches. He said, mom, I don't want to eat lunch there, just breakfast. So that's why you're not going to see breakfast for Weiwei. So what is he taking for lunch today? We have a little love theme going on this week and we're not doing anything super extravagant. I have a lot of things left over still from Christmas that we're using. That's why you haven't seen a lunchbox video in forever and day and I am going through it. So I have these little Pepperidge Farm little mini buns and we made pizza sliders on these today. They love them on like the actual slider buns that I made from Elise Ellis. So I thought I had two left over. Let's do that. Do something different. These little heart silicone I did not get off of Amazon. Can y'all believe I got these from Dollar Tree in a three pack? I could not believe they came in red and pink. So stinking cute. And we have some colorful goldfish in there. Also from Dollar Tree, this cute napkin with like the fake faux wood in the back. I just love what they had for Valentine's. Wasn't much, but they had some cute stuff. I do have some chewy granola bars, Valentine little minis that I had left over from the boys' birthday party. So we're using those up. Underneath, I have some sliced apples for him. He's been on an apple kick. And here I have some too good strawberry yogurt. And then I have these little like hearts, edible hearts from Hobby Lobby that we got for Christmas for the Grinch themed lunch boxes. Again, reusing them and repurposing them. So I have those on top. They love sprinkles on top of their yogurt. And then for his drink, sister got these Yeti cups made for them for their birthday. How cute are these? Had their name on them. And I mean, come on now, bougie with the Yeti. I've got water in there with some of the Simply Clear Strawberry Water Lemonade from Great Value. We love this water enhancer versus the colored ones. The snack for this afternoon, he's got a frozen yogurt stick and the Spider-Man theme from Sam's Club, a Brainiac apple strawberry applesauce, and then these are really cute. These are heart-shaped Cheerios, chocolate Cheerios. However, I did pack these in the boys' lunch boxes already, and they both weren't really a fan of them. I don't know what's going on with that, but we're going to try it again today. So that is what Waylon is taking for this Monday the week theme of love. Trey still loves the breakfast and we've been super basic with it lately. I have not been going overboard. I found these heart shaped Fruit Loops from my local Rouse's supermarket. How cute are those? It's just Fruit Loops, but they're shaped like hearts. I know that Trey's going to love it. Waylon was like, ooh, I think I want breakfast back again because he's obsessed with cereal of all kinds. I know this looks kind of crazy and pitiful, but y'all know if you've watched the Lunchbox videos in the past that Trey loves frozen fruit. And I had one lonely wine men's cup left in the freezer. I'm trying to go through all the things that we have before I replenish and new. And I have done that, but I want to get rid of these like little stowaways back there. We do have a fair life vanilla protein shake. He loves these and I cannot find like all the flavors. My Sam's club has been out of stock, but we have a few of these left. So he's going to take that. So that's his protein source in the morning and then all of his carbs for lunch. I totally forgot to put the little pick on Waylon's when showing you guys, but I went back and put it in there. These are just little heart eye picks how cute he does have turkey pepperoni on his sandwich cheese and classico pasta sauce he's got the same goldfish the same little granola bar and same exact yogurt he's obsessed with yogurt however he's he likes apples a little bit he's not a huge fan he is my fruit lover besides apples and bananas i know so i've got fresh raspberries blueberries and blackberries down there he loves fruit of all kinds like i said and then for snack today i thought i'd give him a fruit cup again i mean loading the boy up with fruit we've got these chocolate cheerios not high hopes for him he's not a huge fan of those but i thought it'd be cute to add for our like pink valentine's red theme a strawberry built bar i have a couple of these that are like you know pink or red colored and he likes any of the built bars that i put in there and this is a great like alternative for a candy bar for your kids too. He absolutely loves them. And then he's going to take the same exact water enhancer drink today. He's got a Yeti cup too that my sister bought him. Super cute and loving that we can pack that instead of maybe like Gatorades and water bottles and save on plastic too. So that's what they're taking for Monday. Let's see what they are. Clearly actually. it was a win today. He's been loving those little pizza sliders. Anything pizza related, Trey has been loving. I'm not so sure about how Waylon's going to do. But as Waylon would say, Trey made a happy plates. So Waylon brought back his applesauce. They both ate the Cheerios, which surprises me because the past couple of times I've packed them, they haven't been a fan. So that's good. He did not do too good on his lunch today. He ate maybe a bite of his sandwich. He ate his goldfish, half of his yogurt stick, almost all of it. Didn't even touch his apples. What is his life? And ate probably half of his yogurt, 
Of course, the granola bar is gone, but he could have did better. He said he had a good breakfast at school, so that makes me happy. But he has been kind of finicky on eating lately, which you'll probably good see. This morning. morning, happy Taco Tuesday. So I mentioned Waylon's been eating breakfast at school, but when he heard what I was packing Trey today, he was like, Mom, I want in on that. And I was like, okay. So I found these Eggo Bites chocolatey chip pancakes in these little bags. You just pop them in the microwave for 30 seconds and they're nice, warm, and fluffy feeling. And that's such a great way to pack their lunch, keep them in there, keep them warm. You just poke a little hole in it to ventilate it and microwave it and you're done. I've got a little bit of this Choc Zero maple pecan syrup. I have a ton of Choc Zero syrups on hand. I do buy the Thrive Market pure maple syrup and we love that too, but I'm just trying to get rid of some things in the pantry like I mentioned in a little condiment cups from Amazon love those I'm almost out and need to make another order and then I asked him what kind of fruit he wanted and he said strawberries he hasn't really been big on his fruit hopefully he will eat it and I have it in that cute little Dollar Tree heart-shaped silicone liner for lunch today since it's Taco Tuesday he's a big fan of nachos on Taco Tuesday still and I still had those red and green chips from Sam's Club I know because we bought one or two bags and then my sister gave me a bag that she had left over from a party we went to and I did pick out the remaining red ones out of there for Valentine's Day. He wanted a banana. Hopefully he will eat it. He's been good most days about eating it now. If you've been watching, he used to not eat them if they were peeled like this. And then I wrote love you with little hearts on it. Super cute. We have a ton of these little miniature Rice Krispie treats left over from Halloween. Yes, I know. We just bought too much stuff in bulk from Sam's Club. I used a little bit of icing and put those little edible hearts on there. How cute is that? And repurposed them kept them out their package. So don't think that you can't reuse a lot of this stuff, guys, and just make it into the next theme lunch. We've got a Go-Gurt stick there that I just squeezed in. And then he loves the Tostinos, the salsa con queso. I have that in there. Snack today, we have some of the Target brand of these little shortbread cookies that are shaped like hearts. Those are so cute and such a great price. And they love to dip like pretzels and cookies in these natural Jif to-go cups. Love that they can get some healthy fats in. And then I kept the same exact apple strawberry <laughs> applesauce that he had in his bag from yesterday. So that is what Waylon is taking for Taco Tuesday. Trey's taking the exact same breakfast. He has a little bit of the mixed berry medley from Walmart. And then he is also taking a Fairlife vanilla protein shake. For lunch, he is not doing nachos. I know, shocking. He's been loving the little banderita street tacos with some pimento cheese, and I pop these in the air fryer and let it get all toasty and melty. And I put those same little eyeball picks on there, and I gave him three of those. He has been loving those lately, so hopefully he'll eat those in his lunch today. I have an assortment of fruit for him, some grapes, blueberries, raspberries, and blackberries, all fresh. He's got the same repurposed Rice Krispie treat, some too good strawberry, and then leftover from Christmas, we've got some red sprinkles. And of course, y'all know they morph overnight and have a little party, so we've got that going on. And he had his thermos last night. He did bring it home from school. Waylon did not bring his home from school, so hopefully he finds it today. I know the struggles with sending things off with these kids. But I'm going to give him a Gatorade zero cents. I can't find his thermos right now, but I know it's here somewhere. And then for snack, he's got the same peanut butter and shortbread cookies. And instead of an applesauce, he likes the little sugar-free cups and he's got mandarins today. So let's see what they actually ate for Taco Tuesday. Trey is home from Taco Tuesday and we have another happy everything. Dang, Trey, you doing awesome, bud. Waylon just rolled in and he maybe ate one or two of his strawberries. Clearly, he loved the pancakes. But he did awesome for lunch, so super proud. He ate all of his yogurt and he did eat his banana, way to go. And then all the chips are gone. Good morning, and happy hump day. So on Wednesdays, we have been doing a hot lunch of some sort and Waylon has been enjoying SpaghettiOs with meatballs. So that's what I have in his thermos right here. We do have his water bottle bag, thank you. And I have a story to tell you all about Trey coming up next. But I've got that just with water with the clear water enhancer in there. For his little side to his hot lunch, we have some ranch veggie straws, a cheese stick where I did put the little heart eyes on, one of those Quaker Valentine's minis, I'm trying to use them up left over from their party, and some sliced apples. For his afternoon snack, he's got a banana that I wrote love you on there, some goldfish colors, and a little tiny box of raisins. For breakfast, Trey is taking a Legendary Foods Pop-Tart. This is a strawberry flavor. They sent me a bunch of the different varieties for the kids when we
we met up at the Las Vegas Keto Expo, I told him how much the kids like them, and they really do, and Trey especially, so I packed one of those for him, and Waylon was eyeing it too, but he said he wanted to eat breakfast at school, so that's what we did. We have some peaches today and some frozen cherries. He's loving all the frozen fruit combo, and then of course we have a Fairlife vanilla protein shake for him for breakfast, so he will be set on protein First thing this morning, protein overload. For lunch today, he is doing his broccoli and pimento cheese combo. He loves that so much. I have that in his thermos. He eats that for dinner quite often as well. And then for the side of his pimento cheese and broccoli, we've got some veggie straws like Waylon took, one of those Quaker Valentine's little bars, and then a bunch of fresh fruit for him because he just loves it, so why not? I try to pump it in whenever I can. Fresh raspberries, blackberries, and blueberries. And I am packing him a strawberry low-fat little knockoff to the Dannon. Snack this afternoon, he's taking a sugar-free fruit cup, some Simply Cheeto puffs and the white cheddar. I get these little bags from Sam's Club, not in club. My club doesn't have them in store, but I get them shipped online. If you're a Plus member, you have lots of options that your club in store does not have. Highly recommend. And also, speaking from Sam's, we got this little cookie variety pack thing. So I'm going to pack them the Teddy Grahams and the honey flavor today. So that's what Trey is taking for a hump day. Let's see what they both actually Trey's back home, and he had another happy day. Like, dang, Trey's been on a roll. I did not tell you guys the story. I totally forgot this morning because I was rushing. But his thermos we found in the trash can. If you have kids with autism, you totally understand some of their phases they go through. And he is a throw everything in the trash can phase right now. Not only did he have this in the trash, I had a hunch. Thank you, Jesus, because the bag was full. We were about to take it out. And I said, let me dig through the trash can. This was at the bottom, along with all of Waylon's brand new Nintendo Switch games. We keep the games in the little cases and every single case that he owns, about five or six games were all in the trash can. Yeah, like, oh my gosh, that would have been a nightmare. So mommy was on point with a hunch, thinking that he threw things in the trash can and why things were missing. If your kids have done that and you have kids with special needs and they go through phases, this will pass. He does this stuff all the time and then he won't do it ever again for maybe four years and then he'll do it again. Uh, let me know and let me know that I'm not alone out there with these kind of things. Waylon ate all his SpaghettiOs. That makes me happy. He did eat his apples. He's not a fan of the peel, I know. Like a bite of his cheese stick. What's up with that? Because he's usually like a fiend with the cheese sticks. Didn't eat his granola bar. That's shocking. He did not touch his raisins or his pitiful looking banana now, but he did eat whatever crackers or whatever I had with it. So not terrible. At least he ate his main Good morning. Happy Thursday. The boys are taking homemade Lunchables today. I have those heart silicone liners from the Dollar Tree. So happy I scored those. That was such a great find. So we've got some Black Forest ham from Sam's Club, some thin slice Sargento cheese here. He hasn't been a fan of the thin slice. He likes the thicker pieces and it does cut up better, I have to say. So hopefully he'll eat that today. We've got some Ritz crackers. These are ones left over I've had in the pantry forever. You're going to see Trey has a different one. These are not Oreos. These are Whole Foods peppermint uh, Oreos, knockoff to Oreos. I still have from Christmas. I told you guys I have so much still on hand. Not anymore, but I did. And that's why you haven't seen a lunchbox video in forever and a day. But I do have a couple of stragglers still. So what I did is I just repurposed them into Valentine's Day Oreos. They actually have like little specks of pink in there for the peppermint, so it's kind of cute. But I just used some icing and put those edible hearts have been coming in clutch and put those on there to make them cute. Same thing with the banana. I put those on there with some icing. Hopefully he'll eat his banana today. He's hit or miss, as you guys know. Got the cute napkin in there, and then we did fill his thermos up with some water and water enhancer. He's not doing breakfast today. He's eating at school, but he is doing afternoon snack, and I'm trying to get rid of the these chocolate Cheerios and the little Valentine pouches are really cute and they did eat them the other day I was super surprised I've got a couple of these that I got from Thrive Market just in the pantry lonely trying to get them out of here these are the Bobo's peanut butter and jelly stuffed oat bites these are like the knockoffs they have like with the Sam's Club brand too and my kids like those these they're hit or miss on so we'll see how he does on that and then for a fruit option, he's got an apple cinnamon applesauce pouch by Brainiac. He likes his Brainiac better than the name brand one. And I get these at Thrive Market as well. So that's what Waylon is taking on Thursday. For breakfast, Trey's taking those same heart-shaped Fruit Loops. I just think those are so adorable. 
And again, trying to go through like the seasonal stuff when we can. He's doing a Fairlife protein shake, the vanilla flavor. And these are hard to find right now. Like everybody's on the bandwagon and my club is out of stock, but I was able to order a couple of cases. I think of the chocolate, all the other ones, including my beloved caramel is out of stock and getting them shipped to the house. And they're too pricey on Amazon and at Walmart. Like Sam's is the only way to do those for a life shake. Some frozen mixed berries from Walmart. He's got a Lunchable as well, but instead of ham and cheese, he's doing pimento cheese and bacon. That's his jam. And then we ran out of the other Ritz crackers finally. So we've got these knockoffs to Ritz from Great Value. These are the wheat buttery blend whatever got a bunch of fruit assortment i have grapes raspberries blueberries and fresh blackberries in there he loves it of all kinds he's got the same drink in his thermos thank you jesus we dug it out the trash and then we've got him a strawberry low-fat yogurt these are the knockoffs to the little danimals like getting those and waylon usually comes home with these and we have to put them in the trash he doesn't drink them but trey loves them and when he's not having like a huge lunch i like to put those on the side for a snack he's gonna do the same thing as waylon but he's doing a fruit cup same cheerios and then i'm putting another one of those strawberry built bars in there he loves the built bars and anytime he can have something like sweet but it's actually a better option than a candy bar or cookies we go that route let's see what they ate for thursday can trey do it Four days in a row. Can he make another happy Trey's home from school? And he almost made a happy plate. He ate some of his bacon, but he left most of it behind. But at least he ate a piece or two. Breakfast is gone, snack gone, and water bottle in return. Waylon ate his banana. Woohoo, way. And then he ate almost all of his Lunchable. He's not a fan of those Oreos, I figure, but at least he tried it. Ate probably the hearts off of it and ate all Good of it. Good morning. Happy Friday. Waylon's got his Yeti cup with his enhanced water in there. We're doing PB&J. We try to keep Friday's super simple. So we've got those Pepperidge Farm sliders with some PB&J. I did do a little icing and put some of that sprinkle sugar on there with a little red heart just to make things cute for the Valentine's Day theme. We've got the silicone liner with some color goldfish. We are going to treat them on Fridays. You're going to see we do things we normally don't do on a regular day because it's Friday. Why not? Got a sugar-free strawberry cup in there. They fit perfectly in these system of containers. Love it. Got some of those heart shortbread cookies from Target. And then we've got some apple slices on the bottom. So that's lunch. For afternoon snack, the kids are obsessed and love that Sam's Club offers them in these little portion bags. So nice. And then also from Sam's, we got that cookie variety pack. And like I said, it's been sitting there for a while because we only let them have these occasionally. But on Friday, we are treating them and I'm giving Waylon the mini Chips Ahoy. He loves any of the ones in the pack. And then for a fruit source, the Brainiac Apple Strawberry Pack. For breakfast, Trey is taking some more of those chocolate chip mini pancakes I heated up in the bag. Loving the convenience of that. Frozen peaches and he is taking pure maple syrup from Thrive Market today. And we're out of shakes for Trey. These are mamas. The salted caramel is my favorite and I can't find it anymore. So I only have a few left and it pained me to give one up to Trey. But we've got some chocolate and vanilla ones on the way. Thank you, Sam's Club. For lunch, he's taking the exact same thing as Waylon, except he's going to be taking some fresh blackberries and raspberries down there. One just popped up on me. For afternoon snack, he's taking a sugar-free fruit cup. Same Cheetos as Waylon. And instead of Chips Ahoy, he's going to take the Oreo minis to treat them today for Friday. Let's see. Trey what just got have. home and he ate everything except his cookies. Like, what is his life? Maybe because he didn't have any peanut butter to dip it in. Waylon ate almost all his goldfish, about half of his sandwich. He said he ate one apple slice. Of course, he ate the jello and he left the fruit behind, but all the other goodies. I mean, it is Friday. He is six years old. If y'all enjoyed today's video, please give it a huge thumbs up. That helps me out so much. I know a lot of y'all have been waiting for these to come back and return. If you are new here, I'd love if you subscribe to the channel and thank y'all for watching and we will see y'all in the next lunchbox video. Y'all have a great weekend.